Today, we're in the herd with women's basketball. After three tough games, Coach Aaron Russell says his team is going to have to pick up its spirit and face Colgate on the road on Wednesday. You know, you talk about seeding and playing at home and where you're playing. Um, that's going to be determined by the, by these next rounds of games here. So um, they're all going to be important, but hey, we go back to our old, our old adage that the next the next game is the most important, and that's that's Colgate. I think the second round um, in any league a lot of times makes for for some ugly basketball, depending on what you're looking for um, uh, in, in a basketball game. So you know, you just you gotta you gotta use the toughness. I think that's something that we've really focused on all season, made that our identity. And sometimes you have to grind these games out, and, and hopefully we can come out on the positive. End. He says he was pleased to see Shelby Romine collect her 1,000th career point in the game against Army. For me, selfishly, it was disappointing not to be able to get the win uh, on the night of, of such a personal, uh, a, a great personal accomplishment. But um, you know, she's to be commended. You know, I think that that nothing takes away from from that career achievement that she was able to get so early in her career. And um, you know, I think we're we're blessed to have her and, and blessed to be a part of future successes down the road for her as well. For her part, Romine says she's pleased to have the support system of coaches and teammates who pushed her and helped her reach that milestone. It's not that I was thinking about it, but it's nice to have people, you know, around town congratulating me and stuff like that. And now it's just, it's kind of out of the way. We can just focus on the team because that's really what's most important is getting the wins as a team. She says she and the team want to start a winning streak as the regular season winds down. They gave us a run for our money here, and I think we've learned a lot since that game. We just have to come out with energy and uh, know that it's a really, really important game for us. So I think, we'll, I think we're going to do well and uh, get the ball rolling, get some momentum. You can catch all the action of the Bucknell Colgate women's game on WVBU 90.5 FM in the Susquehanna Valley or on SportsJuice.com beginning at 6.45 p.m. Wednesday evening.